What's up guys, this is Tampa Tech and I'm gonna show you three ways to connect your phone to your TV screen. Let's go ahead and get started. Now the first way, we're gonna be using an adapter. This is an HDMI to Type-C. I have an Android Samsung S9 phone, which uses a Type-C. They also make cables for micro USB to HDMI. Now you can use this adapter connecting to an existing HDMI cable that's connected to your TV, or you can connect this cable right here, which is a longer extension cable, and it's uh, Type-C, you connect that to your phone, and of course the HDMI connects to one of the inputs on your TV, input one, two, or three. As long as you have a free HDMI input, that's good to go. So with this adapter, you simply just plug it into your phone, like so, and plug it into an existing HDMI cable. Uh, you can take it from your cable box or your PlayStation 4, whatever um, device is using HDMI cable. But make sure you're on that TV input or else you won't be able to see what's on the screen. So I got a free HDMI port right here. This is the side HDMI port. Plug in right there. And I'm gonna turn on the TV and switch to input. HDMI side input. And there you have it, right there. So it's really simple. This way is just plug and play. Just plug it in, and within a couple seconds, it'll toggle without me changing any settings, and it'll be up on the screen. Um, this is actually a really, it's 1080p, the resolution. This is really reliable source because it's not Wi-Fi. Uh, wireless connection, you may lose signal depending on how far away you are from the router. And you can um, turn it this way, it'll work just the same. Somewhere in your farm that has no so whether you're holding it vertical or horizontal, it's gonna show you the same on the screen. And it reacts pretty quick and the resolution is 1080p. Now my screen right here is 1440p because it's a Samsung S9, but on the TV, it's maxed out at 1080p. Uh, another way to screencast your phone to your TV is using a Google Chromecast. This is a great device, works for iPhone and Android phones. It's easy to set up. I'm gonna show you how to screencast from your phone to the TV. This is the newer version of the Chromecast. So I'm gonna take my Chromecast and plug it into the open HDMI port on my TV. Now, a lot of people do is when they plug in this Chromecast, they plug it into the TV USB port. Don't do that because you're missing out on a lot of features like the HDMI control CEC feature where the Chromecast will tell the TV to turn on and change the input automatically. What you should do is connect it to the Chromecast power adapter to an AC outlet, not the TV USB port. All right, so now it's plugged in. Just wait a couple seconds while it turns on. Once that white light is solid, then we should be good to go. I already did a video how to set up the Chromecast. So if, you want, if you're interested in that video, check out my Google playlist. All right, so next what you wanna do is click on the hamburger menu. All right, next you wanna select cast screen. All right, next it's gonna ask you what device that you wanna cast to. And we're gonna cast to the game room TV. Now let's go ahead and get out of this. As you can see, everything works as same as pretty much as before. And hit play. It works great as an intercom system. I'm gonna pause, you can turn it this way. And you can see uh, there's a little bit more delay in the Wi-Fi version, but it still works really well. And this will work on any app, even eBay. Now anytime you wanna disconnect, you just swipe down, click on casting screen and select disconnect. Now the third way to cast your phone screen to the TV is by swiping down. Some phones have this feature, some phones don't. And then swipe down again and then slide over and select smart view. Now if your TV has a feature where you could cast your phone to the TV screen, then it would find that device. You wanna make sure that Wi-Fi is turned on and you're on the same wireless router. If not, this is not going to work and it won't find your device. So as you can see, it found my device because we're on the same network. So select that. 
and boom, we're back and we're up and running once again. And you select eBay, whatever app you want, and it'll display on your screen. Make sure you download Real Link app, and then you can select disconnect. So if you guys are interested in any of these devices, check out the links in the video description below. If you're interested in the iPhone version of this cable, check out the video link in the video description below. I made a separate video for that. If this video was informative, give me a big thumbs up. If you're interested in any of these products, check out the links in the video description below. And if you know anyone that may be interested in screencasting their phone to their TV, click on the share button below, share this video to them, help someone out. And if you want to subscribe to Tampa Tech for more how-to videos like this, click on the subscribe link right here or the subscribe button down below. Thanks guys for watching. Bye.